What's going on everyone, Talon back here, and today it is time to test out my latest rainbow, and no, it is not Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, it is my Super Saiyan Physical Gotenks, that is right, I got that beast up to 100%, and he hits like a beast, he hits like one, I mean, there's, there's no denying it, right, he hits like a beast, so I am taking him on his best current team as of right now, I'm actually gonna have one of my Gogetas off rotation, so that we don't just go through the whole event like no tomorrow but we're going to be linking him up with his best friend super saiyan 3 gotenks on this team and then obviously he'll be doing really nicely when uh pandel comes around every now and then to get that extra 30 percent uh, in the attack and everything but unfortunately he's not around until the third rotation because you know luck of the draw and all that stuff so anyway so let's get right into it we're gonna you know see how much he can do you know all that stuff he's at level 15 critical he has level uh, six additional, and then he has level five, or no, six dodge and level five additional, so, I mean, on this team especially, he's always supering, right, he's always getting his super off, it's really easy to, and there's really no need for the whole additional attack, because, well, he's gonna seal, yes, you could make the argument that he's gonna just, you know, he's gonna do double the damage, but it's just like, yeah, or I can give him crits, and he can just take him out in one hit, so, and that's just the way I like to do it. And then, uh, I haven't seen how much he can take a hit for, especially against a physical type, so I'm actually going to put uh, Go Tanks off rotation because I want him to be with my physical Go Tanks, or Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks with my physical Go Tanks, so we're going to do that instead. So we're going to do that, and then Go Tanks there, we'll get that. Uh, this team is starting to get pretty dangerous. Uh, Go Tanks is rainbow now. Gogeta Int is rainbow now. I have two paths unlocked on the Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks. Gogeta Super Saiyan 4 has one path unlocked at the bottom right. It's getting pretty disgusting how dangerous this team is gonna get, so... Uh, it's like, it's my go-to team, right? It's like, okay, I, I know I can take on any event with this now. So, okay, so here's Gotenks. He does not get a better link there, so... Um, he just shares a couple of links there, but we're gonna give him the doubt, and... Because I don't want Go. I want him to block against Goku, but I know Gogeta will probably finish this up in one hit, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, and we'll give that to Vegito. So, all right, let's see how much it go takes to hit for. Who I am liking that damage right there. Oh, come on. Give me that critical, baby. Give me that critical. Oh, he's not giving me the critical. <laughs> it's so underwhelming when he goes against a tight disadvantage. It's like, oh, 200. Woo! <laughs> and then, see, Gogeta just coming in like no tomorrow. So... <laughs> Uh, but thankfully when we start going against Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, we're gonna have Gotenks, Super Saiyan 3, and, uh, Super Saiyan Gotenks taking everything, so... Vegeta, uh, Vegito here take- unfortunately taking a little bit of damage, but it's okay. So, we'll do that, and we'll give you that. You're sealed, so it doesn't really matter what happens here. And we're gonna finish him up, so... The real, the real show will really be when we hit Super Saiyan 4 Gotenks. Because like I said, Gogeta Super Saiyan 4 will be off rotation. So, to particularly show just how good the Gotenks is going to be. Because he's going to be linking up really nicely with the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. So, okay. Getting done with that. We are going on to the real part of it now. Let's go to Vegeta. Sorry, Vegeta. Your sons are going to take... Uh, one of your sons and his best friends are going to take it down. So... Yeah, the original Fusion Master. The original Fusion Master. You thought Gogeta was the original Fusion Master. No, no, no. Gotenks need to learn Fusion first. So, technically Goku taught him, but you get the idea. So, does that give you more... No, I want Gotenks to super. So, we're going to do that. We give that to Gotenks, which is total overkill. But it doesn't matter, right? It does not matter. We have to make sure that we do get a Doken mode with the Gotenks, though. And here we go. How much is he going to do? Come on. Oh, stop. <laughs> He's getting... Start giving me the criticals. Like, what the heck, game? Come on. Watch. Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks is going to get the criticals. Just watch. Oh, Jeff. I knew it. I knew it was going to happen. I knew it was going to happen. So, I'm going to purposely not give these guys uh, supers if possible. But, of course, it's going to be really impossible here. So, I have no choice here. Yeah, we're unfortunately going to have to do that. So... Yeah, that's a downside to showing off the strongest team, right? <laughs> and the same thing would be happening on a super physical team, right? You know, he'd always be having key, he'd always be having the super attack going off, and everyone everyone would be, right? And everyone else would be doing criticals, and it's just like, oh, okay. So, okay, so let's try to do this and see if we can get it going. All right, go tanks. Oh, this is a actually really, really, really good. This is perfect here. And we'll give that to go tanks there. And that's the All right, come on. This is like his best setup. 
Come on, show me what you got, Go Tanks. Critical, take Vegeta down in one hit. Come on. I'll give you a little 50. 50. There we go. That's what I like to see. That's some good damage right there. Don't forget, though, the barrier is always attached to him. So, uh, to the Vegeta, at least. So, all right. Throwing double double criticals? I'll take it. I'll take it. All right. Okay, you're nowhere near the Joker mode yet. Okay. And we will throw that Gogeta off rotation, which is totally fine. They'll probably finish up Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, or Vegeta just because of type advantage, which is a little unfortunate, but you, you guys get the idea. All right. This is my Gogeta right here, so he'll probably wipe him out one hit. If not, Gogeta into there. We'll just take him down. Oh, no, critical. I was impressed. Okay. Unless he supers here. Yep. So, no, he's done. We are done. Um, sorry, by the way, if you guys are hearing something that slams against the window or anything like that. We're in the middle of a typhoon, so. <laughs> but I am still bringing you guys content, right? I am that dedicated. <laughs> All right, let's see what Gogeta. Just do a wipe out. Like, no problem. Woo-wee. The typhoon going on like no tomorrow. Yeah, we're already in warning right here, so the only thing next is, like, emergency warning. <laughs> So don't worry, we're we're okay. These these buildings are pretty stable. So we haven't lost power. That's the most important part. <laughs> Alright, let's see what Go Tanks can do. Ooh, here's another perfect example of Go Tanks kicking butts. Um, you know what? We'll actually put him here. Just because actually I wanna see how much he uh, yeah, I mean he already tanks a lot, it doesn't really matter, I guess. We'll do that. Do that to Go Tanks to get his 11 key, because I like giving him his 11 key, it's always fun. And then we'll do that. So, so, okay. Now, next turn, do not give anyone their colored orbs, and then Go Tanks can get the Doken mode next turn. This will be perfect. And he'll have Pantel with him, so at least he should. No, do have Gogeta with him? No, have Gogeta with him. Darn it, he's not gonna have Pantel with him. Darn, I was hoping for that extra thirty percent. That would have been nice right there. All right, so Vegito, not bad. All right, just don't give anyone their. Color and we should be okay. There we go. Give you those. And we'll give you those. Okay. Perfect. All right. He's going to get the Doken mode next turn. It's going to be awesome. So, unfortunately, no support to be helping him, but <laughs> yeah, it's okay. All right. And plus, we'll take out both the uh, uh, Agility Cooler and his little minion guy. So, we'll take him down. Salzer, whatever his name is. No one cares about him. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we can get the... And we're going to see how much he can take against an int, which, I mean, I know it's going to be double digits already, but, you know, you get the idea. We give those to you so we get the token mode. There we go. Okay. Let us see. I'm going to say if he gets a critical, we're going to be looking at... Some, oh, how's he going to take this? 3,000. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So, okay. Uh, predictions right now. I'm going to say non-critical 2.2. And if he gets a critical, I'm going to say 3.1, give or take. Kind of a random ballpark, but we're going to see where he goes with it. So, come on. Give it to me, go tanks. Come on, get that critical. I want to see that critical. And I realized I called him the agility core earlier. It was actually the one. 2.6 with the non-critical. Okay, so I was pretty close. Not bad, not bad at all. This is the agility cooler. This is the agility cooler. Okay. And then we'll see how much he can tank against uh, physical cooler. So that should be pretty fun. All right, so we're going to do that. So we'll give you those. Doesn't matter what we get here. And why not? We'll give Vegito the super, even though he doesn't need... Oh, <laughs> we're countering this. Yeah, not going the way he wants it, probably. <laughs> Crit. Yeah, you're getting the critical for 1.2. <laughs> Gogeta, man. OP as heck. All right, what we got here? Come on. Critical? All right, well, let's finish him off. I mean, that, that round was going to finish him off no matter what. All right, let's see what Gotenks can do now against Physical Cooler. Physical v. Physical. Let's see what he can do. So, I'm going to give you those. Uh, I can give you... Sweet, 11 key. That's what I'm talking about. And we'll get that. So, as long as this is super me first. Good. 13,000. Okay, it's not bad for blocking. It's not bad. It's not bad. He's obviously not meant to be the defensive guy. So, let's see if he gets a critical. Nope, non-critical. Okay, that's not bad. Not bad. All right, and he sealed them up, so he can't super us now. So that's really nice. Let's continue on. Boom. As you guys can tell, this obviously isn't the race way of doing it, right? Like, otherwise, you'd have Super Saiyan 4, Gogeta around every turn to try to beat the times and everything like that. So, 
Once I get Gotenks a little bit more, the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks a little bit more uh, orbs into him, I'm going to attempt that race again. And I'm going to beat that time. I don't know who holds it right now. I think Dino holds it. I don't remember. But either way, it's on. It's on like Donkey Kong. So there we go. That's an old reference right there. <laughs> okay, come on. Finish it up, Gogeta. Finish it up. Get that critical. You know you want to. All right, or you just you know take it down like you know tomorrow. It's perfectly fine. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, the next spot that Gotenks can really shine is gonna be Boo. So we're just gonna we're gonna breeze right through this and see what we can do. So get you there, boom. Nice thing is giving Gotenks all his 11 key. I like I like doing that. So I know his 12 key is obviously still really powerful, uh, unlike his tech version and all that. But 11 key is still the strongest one. So. Uh, always best to give him the strongest one, right? All right, we'll see what Gotenks can bring us. He's really not getting the criticals today, is he? He really isn't. He's gotten, what, once? Yeah, once, I think. Maybe twice, I don't know, but either way, he's not really getting the criticals. He's got the maximum you can potentially get, so that is the downside. Uh, okay, so the big question, of course, is always going to be... Is it worth not? Is it not? Is it worth the orbs? Obviously, it's worth the orbs in the end. But is it worth your time over somebody, another physical unit you might have? Um, if maybe say you have quite a few, and I would say yes, it is. Go tanks is easily worth the orbs uh, to, uh, over your other guys, except maybe cooler. I would definitely say cooler. Um, I'd even I'd, I'd actually put him above Super Saiyan Three Go Tanks because Super Saiyan Go, Go Tanks already just hits hard. So uh, I would definitely put Go Tanks in there because he can definitely take a hit. If you have the right... Oh, you're not going to get a super. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. Okay, we'll give you that, I guess. That's two, at least. And that's a Gogeta. Okay. Yeah, honestly, I would say, though, that he... I put him over Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks just because... We already know Gotenks hits really hard, right? The super, This Super Saiyan Gotenks, at least for me personally, he's going to hit He's gonna hit really hard, obviously. He's going to block. He seals, which is really nice, and he dodges, so it, it works really well. Not to mention, he's got a little bit of a, a little bit of a better link set overall because he has things like prepare for battle and fusion. So, especially if you're running him on a, a hybrid team, the hybrid Gohan team, he fits better because he not only gives that plus one key to Gohan to allow him to get his secret a little bit easier, but he links better with all the prepare for battle guys. Whereas Gotenks does not. He only has over to flash and fusion. So unless they're together. They're not going to get that, so um, that is one thing to keep in mind right there that I didn't notice when back even before I got my Go Tanks here rainbowed. So and I realized how low I am on health. So woo, a typhoon, scary. All right, Gogeta will most likely finish him up. Not much I can do here. Two point five seven. Jeez. Ooh, wait. Okay. Gogeta will finish this up, and then we'll move on to Boo real quick. So, not too long of a video here. All right, so we finished off. I'm going on to Boo. Wow, it's been a while since I've done a Boo video, right? or Boo part of the video, because usually I stop at Go Goku, because this is like, oh, this video is hitting like 20 minutes already, so. All right, let's see what we got here. Come on, Boo. You know you'll want to give it to me. Come on. All right, go tanks. I'm going to say you're going to do a lot of damage, probably. Do that right there. That's the nice thing about Go Tanks here on Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks, at least on this particular stage, is because of all the candy and everything. If you already had 11 key, you just hit the candy and then boom, you say 11 key, which is really nice. So, oh hey, you two are copying each other, except one blasts through the earth and the other just fist bumps, I guess. <laughs> all right, and this, and that. And I just realized we're not going to have a Gogeta to counter against the physical move, but that's okay. I'll just heal up and uh, lower his attack or lower or lower his attack or raise our defense or whatever I decide to do. But yeah, we'll do that right there. Whew. All right. Yeah, we're definitely taking this guy down. I want to be careful though, because I do not want to take out the int in one hit. Because unfortunately, the int is really weak. So that is a downside. So we're going to raise the, we're going to heal up like this. So we should be okay. We'll let him seal. We'll do that, and we'll do that right there. I don't know if we're gonna let him get to get a chance to take on Boo. 
be very interesting. Dodge? No? Okay, fine. That's fine. 44, that's 44,000. You should be able to take him. This turn will maybe wipe him out. I'm hoping not. No critical. Okay, good. Good. Uh, one time I'm asking for no critical. Go tanks. No critical. Please. Pretty please with cherry on top. Of course. He <laughs> gets the additional. <laughs> Vegito still would have finished him off, I think, but still. It's kind of like, oh. <laughs> so, you know what I'm going to do? Is we're going to split you two up. Do that. Do that. And... Uh, no, you're going to get two no matter what. Crap, he's going to get the super off. All right, don't finish him off, please. Okay, come on. No additional, no additional. Okay, good. Gogeta's got level 9 additional. I did that whole level 9 additional, level 12 critical thing with Gogeta. So, he should, you know, thankfully he didn't super attack. So, I don't, and even if he gets a critical, I don't think Gogeta Super Saiyan 4 will finish him off. I want Gotenks to get the final blow off of him and finish him off. Okay. He's only, he's not even a life bar down, I think. So, come on. No additional. He supered Gogeta already, thankfully. Good. Okay. We're okay. We're okay. Gotenks is going to finish this up. Just the way I wanted it to go. Okay. So anyway, guys, that is basically going to be it for the video because uh, we're, we're done. We are done. And boom. There we go. So I'm going to say against Int, if he gets a critical 3 million, non-crits 2.6, 2.7 probably, just based off of the other cooler. So oh, he's going to get that last super. He's going to get that last super in 23,000. Get out of here, boo. All right, go, tanks. Wrap it up. Ja -ja <laughs> wow, I'm... What? Huh? <laughs> okay, then. I way overshot those numbers. What the... <laughs> Am I missing something? I'm missing something here. I don't, I don't know what it is. I'm missing something. But, all right, guys. There we go. That's going to be it for the video. Obviously, Gotenks, a beast like no tomorrow. Like I said, personally, the orbs, I would put him over the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks just because of how well he can fit on other teams besides just the Fusion teams. Again, Gotenks goes great on the Hybrid Sand team and the Heroes team and pretty much anything, right? He's got to prepare for battle, unlike the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. My personal opinion, though. So, again, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. As always, leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you happen to be new. And until next time, everyone, I'll see you in the next one.